How to adjust a Briggs Stratton Pulse Jet Carburetor The Briggs & Stratton Pulse Jet Carburetor regulates fuel flow on the aluminum series of engines. The most common application of this carburetor is for small horsepower lawnmowers and rototillers. The Pulse Jet Carburetor resides above the onboard gasoline tank. Fuel is drawn up into the device through two fuel suction lines. A single needle valve resides near the rear of the carburetor unit, that faces the push handles of the mower or rototiller. The needle valve has a slot-type screw head. Things you'll need Slot head screwdriver Close the needle valve with the screwdriver in a clockwise direction. Open the needle valve one and a half turns in a counterclockwise direction. This setting allows the engine to be started and warm to operation temperature. Keep the air filter in place for correct adjustment. Start the engine according to the manufacturer's instructions for the device. Accelerate the engine to operational speed. Turn the needle valve in a clockwise direction, closing it, until the engine begins to lose speed. Slowly back the needle valve out, counterclockwise direction, until the engine smooths out. Test the engine under a full load condition. Mow grass with a lawnmower or cultivate soil with the rototiller. Turn the needle valve slightly in a counterclockwise direction if the engine loses speed while under full load conditions. It may take several minor adjustments to the needle valve in order to get the best performance from the engine. Tips Warnings Use only fresh gasoline in the engine when performing the above adjustment as old gasoline will cause the engine to operate erratically. If the device fails to adjust properly after following the above steps, the two fuel suction lines may be clogged. There are small screens in the ends of both plastic tubes. The carburetor must be removed from the fuel tank and the lines or screens cleaned.